The compound profile option on the simple extrude tool allows you to extrude several objects at once, leaving holes um, where the inside profiles are. So, for example, I'm going to extrude this rectangle and all four of these circles, and there will be four holes in the 3D object. So I'm going to switch over into a nice slightly isometric view, and I'll tab down into the height field, and I'll go ahead and type in one inch for this exercise. Now, since I use the compound profile to do this, I can still make changes. So I can go ahead and select that circle, put the selector tool into 2D mode, I can go ahead and move around the circle, and where the circle goes, the hole follows. I can move this circle around. You see, so if I did it wrong in the first place, I can make all these changes. So I can go ahead and also change the size of the circle, too. I can also change the size of the rectangle. Move around the circle some more. So you see there's a great many editing options when I use the compound profile when using the simple extrude.